people it is me porky 2007 so welcome back to another review today we are not reviewing a lego item today we are reviewing a pixar cars die cats item this is the speedway of the south 11 pack and no this is not the motor speedway of the south 36 pack where it comes with all the racers including mac icar no not that i'm too poor to get that um so yeah um this is the Speedway of the Self 11 pack. I got this for my birthday. And, um, yeah, let's open it. I already opened this. Wait, hold on, let me just show the unboxing. Okay, there we go. I already opened this because, well, you know, it was just too cool. And by the way, all of the, by the way, all of the characters are attached to tape. Or, I mean, yeah, it is. Yeah, they are attached to tape just so it can make it look like it's brand new in the box. All right, just give me a minute to just, you know, get all this out. All righty, let's review. So let's start with um, Lady McQueen. Um, this is just a typical um, Thailand McQueen. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure you've seen these before. Um, this Thailand McQueen is, well, you know, not the 2022 one because it doesn't have those holes where um, Mater's toe hook can, you know, fit in. Yeah, um, yeah, I think, yeah, I think you already know what Lady McQueen looks like or specifically a typical Thailand McQueen. Next up, we got Strip Weathers, a.k.a. The King. Um, um, just like McQueen, I'm pretty sure you already, um, no, uh, know about this diecast. Um, it's a Thailand one, obviously. Or all of these are made in Thailand. Before this, all the eleven packs were uh, made in Vietnam. Which, to be honest, um, <coughs> sorry, sorry, Vietnam cars are just god awful. And um, yeah, and um, yeah, this is a typical Thailand king. I think I've already seen him. And, um, Chick Hicks, same thing. Typical, um, Thailand McQueen. Not McQueen Chick. I mean, if you want proof that all of these are made in Thailand, well, um, here you go. It says made in Thailand. Now, look, we got all the three main characters. Now, let's move on to the background characters. Next up, we got Chuck Armstrong, Mood Springs, who is inaccurately, um, named as the Throttleman, like, get the packaging okay um look he is inaccurately named the throttleman even though that's the cars 3 mood springs racer and by the way that is not chuck armstrong it's using the rpm body because uh, it has that <laughs> uh, I, I i'm sorry i that, that's just funny and you um yeah um yeah, um, it's space. Yeah, this is yeah Chuck Armstrong. Um, a nice um car to have, I guess. Hopefully, I can get his damaged version, but that is rare. Next up, we got Deakston Diavestito Chunk Fresh. Um, yeah, enough said. Very nice details. I mean, the details are a bit fuzzy because this is silent. But if you look at it from far away, um, the details just look as nice. And, uh, if you want to look at the back, um, here you go, I guess. Next up, we got Billy Oil Changer, Octane Gang. Although, for some reason, uh, mines have these, he has these brownish, dark brownish wheels. Even though, um, it's supposed to have the plain black wheels. I mean, I mean, um, I mean, do all of your Billy Oil Changers look like this with the brown wheels or... For or for the Thailand one at least, yeah. Here's the back. It's basically the same mold as um Dakes and the Avocado, which these two share the um RPM body. This one shares the Aiken Axle and Etchweight body. Next up, we got um a Dynico Pity, which I forgot his name because this wait does it say it on the on the packaging? No, it just says Dynico Pity. But I do know this character has a name. And I forgot his name, um, 
Yeah, just uh, dying, yeah, just the Dynago Pity. We have this Dynaco toolbox, which um, enough said. It's just a toolbox with Dynaco on it. We got um Charlie Checker, I think that's the name, and um, yeah, enough said. Charlie Checker, um, yeah, just nice decals, I guess. Even though they're fuzzy because it's made in Thailand. Next up, we got um Race Official Tom, just like um. Just like check Charlie. Um, nice decals. Fuzzy. Because Thailand. Yeah. Enough said. I mean, I mean, there's not a lot to talk about these characters. Because they're basically just re-releases instead of new releases. And that is kind of a problem with, um, with um, 11 packs and 5 packs. Because most of them are just re-releases. They're not like, you know, new characters. Next up we have, um, what's his name again? Um, Brad Winfler. I'm pretty sure I pronounced his last name wrong. Now look, guys, I think he is um, a Chick Hicks fan because there's this Piston Cup sign that is green. Also, by the way, do all of your Brads have this black mark? Because for some reason mine has. thought it was a chip, but no, it now looks printed on. Uh, comment down below if, if you have Brad and um, there's a black mark right there. Next we got um Carla Vandersman. I think it's called that. No, Darla, not Carla, Darla. It's obviously a uh, a King fan because we have this blue crown. And um yeah, enough said. So that is the speedway of the South Eleven pack, and what do I think of it? I mean it's nice. I mean it's nice I don't have all these characters. So it's good for um collectors are just starting their um cars collection, but um there's a problem with these eleven packs and these five packs, including this one as well, is that they're just mostly um re-releases. They uh, rarely have any new characters or a new variant or a re-release of a character we haven't seen for a while. I mean, like almost all these characters are released in singles or two packs. Like you can find this McQueen as a single. Uh, you can find this the king. You can find the king with a two pack with Mrs. The King. You can find Chick Hicks as a single as well, and also a two pack with one of his pities. I mean, these three aren't singles, but I'm pretty sure they will be soon. I think the Extendi Avocado was already a single. I think in the Blue Desert line, um, the Dynico Pity also without um he doesn't have a single, but but um but um yeah still um he's probably gonna have a single soon. Um, Charlie Checker, he already has a single, and um, you could find Race Official Tom with um, or I mean, I mean um, I mean, you, I mean you can find Race Official Tom in a two pack with Lightning McQueen. I'm pretty sure this guy is a single, and uh, finally uh, she is definitely a single because I saw her at Target. So yeah, that's the problem. They're mostly re-releases that you can find as singles. I mean, um, here are some examples. Um, you know that um, Tuners 5-pack where it comes with all the Tuners and Lightning McQueen? Unfortunately, though, that Lightning McQueen is basically the same as this one. And um, I'm planning to get that 5-pack um, because, well, you know, I want the Tuners. But unless that Lightning McQueen has those holes that Mater can put his toe hook in, um, I don't know what to do with that McQueen. And here is a very, um, very, um, very good example of this problem that is that a uh, walmart.com exclusive cars on the road salt flats um nine pack where um all of them except for except for one which is that um long orange character they're all just duplicates and i most and i and i have most of the characters except for um revo cost and um that long orange dude <laughs> or i think it's her i don't know so yeah, that's the problem with these. Um, they're all just re-releases or duplicates, or or yeah, yeah. That they rarely have new characters, new variants, or a character that hasn't been released for a while. I mean, like I, I mean, like I wish this. I mean, I wish it came with some obscure racers like um, Dale Earnhardt Jr. or Mac Icar, but those are not going to be be in these. Be in these um, 11 slash 5 packs or as a single because 
well, because copyright, you have to wait a while for them to actually get a re-release because, well, you know, you gotta wait for the toy company to get the rights of it. So yeah, um, so yeah, if you're starting off your um, collection, your Cars collection, I do recommend this, but unless you already have a Cars collection, uh, maybe don't buy it because they're just re-releases. And um, yeah, and you, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you like and subscribe and goodbye.